Mr. Mount Vesuvius and Mayor Herbert Knapp have in common. They both smoke. Knapp has been smoking in his office for years and despite a ban, doesn't plan on stopping. I've been smoking since I was 17. I like to smoke and it really relaxes me at work. But it doesn't comply with the non-smoking law. It's a protective law for non-smokers. It's not to protect smokers from themselves. Manfred Wiesker, an anti-smoking activist, doesn't agree. Encouraged by the success of smoking bans in pubs, Wiesker has decided to tackle the city mayor. Paragraph 3, smoking ban. Within the framework of this law, smoking is banned in establishments referred to in paragraph 2, from number 1 to 8. But the mayor thinks he's found a loophole and has allocated his office as the smoking room, because according to the law, a smoking room is allowed. It's said that a smoking room can be set up at the discretion of the head of the board. And if I make this a smoking room, it's covered by the law, no matter whether the authorities think it's a good idea to smoke. Knapp is following in a great tradition of smokers like Winston Churchill, Ludwig Erhard, Helmut Schmidt, and Queen Margarete of Denmark. But the anti-smokers think the mayor should be subject to the same rules as everyone else. The town hall already has an allocated smoking zone which he is free to use, this small room. Sein Büro ist eben ein Büro, was von he has visitors, assistants, secretaries and co-workers coming into his office. So he can't declare it a smoking room. It's outlined very clearly in the law. But what do the citizens of Neuss make of it all? Do they agree with the anti-smoking activists? There are a few idiots who want to cause trouble. That is him. It's that crazy. Is it's completely patronizing in my eyes. I'd say it's okay if there's a smoking room. Meanwhile, Knapp is reading up in a bid to make his private smoking room legitimate. The mayor's office will go by the name of Herbert's Havana Lounge. Rainer Breuer from the SPD smoked for 25 years himself, but has no sympathy when it comes to Knapp's nicotine obsession. I'm always happy to be lenient, but the mayor has to keep to established laws. It damages his credibility when he starts playing by his own rules. But this warning leaves the mayor cold. And even if his superiors forbid him to smoke in the town hall, there's no way he'll be giving up the coffin nails. <laughs>